Hello and welcome to my unboxing and first look at the Gloom Spike Gits Bad Moon Loon Shrine for Age of Sigma. It's £35 for this scenery kit. It's quite a chunky box. Let's unwrap this Loon Shrine. Uh, I've been meaning to get one of these for ages. There's no way on earth I'll be able to justify its paint uh, painting scheme but it's a nice scenery piece nice mini to go with all of the gloom spike kits that i'll be getting over the, the christmas period um let's have a look at the reverse uh you've got this this moon he's got a very angry face this one yeah it looks like it's just you know two halves put together we'll we'll see how it how it goes and um, you've also got this uh, moon there uh, and some mushrooms, more mushroom, mushrooms everywhere, mollusk things, uh, fungi, stalic rooms, stalic mushrooms, I don't know. Uh, you've got a skeleton in there and a, uh, and a tusk. Uh, looks cool, it looks like the little uh, squigs and the, the gits make their way into this uh, hole, this moist uh, cavern, of course. It's uh, very inviting. Uh, let's. Uh, have a look and I think it's only got two sprues. It's a two sprue kit. It's not too bad, you know, £17.50 each per sprue, I guess. Um, you've got this instruction guide. It says 2019, but it is in black and white and that's one of the telltale features of a, a, a kit made in China. Um, it doesn't say anywhere here that it's made in China though. This is the guide, uh, shouldn't take too long to put together. Look, you literally put two halves of moons together um, and then you add the little moon to the big moon. Uh, you add the tusk, you add all the mushrooms, and more mushrooms, wow. And the uh, cages, uh, and more cages if you wish. And then that's it. And then you've got the uh, battle scroll too. So there you go, that's the instruction guide. Let's have a look at these juicy, uh, big uh, sprues then. Now you can tell that that's a made in China kit because it's a slightly darker plastic and uh, has less detail. Typically the scenery, scenery kits have less detail. Um, I tell you what though, the detail that is on there is fantastic. I love this moon, I love the teeth, I love the mollusks or growths. And um, there's a load of skulls there. That's interesting and a skeleton and the cages and there's the, the mushrooms. Um, I'm not quite sure if it's just one uh, sprue duplicated. I really do think that this is two that they've had to produce and we'll have a look at the differences in a, in a moment and the main reason for that is because of the uh, moist cavern uh, in one of the other sides of, of this uh, kit so we'll have a look at that right now. Here it is here, um, nice cutout, nice shape, you've got some uh, mushrooms growing there and the other side of the the uh, moon face um, you've got another bit of scenery with a load of um, skulls and more mushrooms and the tusk this time uh, more mushrooms all the way around and uh, this overgrowth thing and some mini mushrooms and uh, yeah some rope I think or whatever that is but uh, yeah looks uh, lovely feels great um, I can't recommend this kit enough already I think it's fantastic and uh, it's gonna look uh, awesome um, with your, your gloom spike kits or any goblins or orcs or anything that you've you've got going. So there you go, that is my uh, unboxing and first look at the gloom spike kits Bad Moon Loom Shrine. I hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, can't wait to give you a review at some point soon. But what do you guys think? Put it in the comments below as always. Thank you ever so much for joining me today. Thank you for watching. The Loom King Protects.